go. Psychiatrists are physicians trained to treat a variety of mental health disorders, such as mild anxiety to bizarre and erratic behavior and other mental disorders that can cause self-destruction. Um, psychiatrists may be called for a numerous social issues, including juvenile delinquency, substance abuse, fa family and marital dysfunction, legal competency, and, and le in legal and financial matters, and treatment of mental and emotional problems in prison inmates and the military. Shit. <laughs> they use several types of treatment. They can prescribe drugs, use shock therapy and psychotherapy. Psychotherapy is whenever the doctor asks the patient about their emotional and health problems and they try to find a way for them to cope with their problems um, soberly. Um, unlike psychologists or therapists, psychiatrists are physicians who can prescribe medicine and admit people into hospitals. In order to become a psychiatrist, usually you have to go through four years of college, four years of medical school, and three years of residency at, in psychiatric hospitals. And um, between one to two of those years, they must take an exam so they become a licensed psychiatrist. For my social issue, I chose substance abuse. Substance abuse is whenever someone becomes so dependent on a drug, it basically takes over their entire life. 23.9 million Americans admitted to using illicit drugs or other mood altering uh, medications such as tranquilizers or sedatives in the past month. Um, drugs override the natural reward and punishment center of the brain, um, leading the user to believe that it's <laughs> providing advantages for them when really it just causes self-destruction and it leads to a vicious cycle of addiction. Um, users have common traits such as inconsistent work quality, poor concentration, lowered productivity, mistakes, error in judgment, carelessness, and needless risk taking. Uh, prevalence of substance abuse and psychiatric illnesses consists between 22 to 66 percent of people with psychiatric illnesses. They are likely using the substance to cover up the mental disorder it may have, likely bringing them into an all-time low once the drug wears off, which can lead into addiction. As a psychiatrist, one of the best ways we can help the patient is um, education and providing them with medicines to help them cope with their problems without abusing drugs. Also, you can help them find the root of their problem and help, help them cope with that without using drugs. And that's basically it, so.